Last week, the Supreme Court heard a case of, regarding a Texas law designed to help women make more informed decisions and increase their safety while having abortions. Opponents of this law argue that this law and others like it make it more difficult for women to have abortions, specifically those who are poor, racial minorities, and live in rural areas whose healthcare access is already tenuous. Surprisingly, nobody had actually tested to see whether this was the case. So I did, using a nationally representative survey of abortion patients and state level laws. I found that requiring counseling in a waiting period, as well as having to travel farther distances, um, affected how many weeks pregnant a woman is when she has her abortion, or the abortion timing. Furthermore, um, black women's abortion timing was more affected by distance traveled than white women. And state laws affected black women differently based on their income, whereas all white women were similarly affected. The difference in some cases was three weeks, enough to push women back to more expensive and complicated second trimester abortions. Essentially, these laws that are passed to help increase women's health and safety are actually harming them. My research has serious implications for public policy, as well as ensuring that no woman's access to abortion is different and not equal. Thank you.